everyone. Welcome to another episode of the Cubica AMF Tech Tip Podcast. This is a weekly podcast where we take you on a journey through the fascinating world of bowling technology and beyond. I am your host, Orly. I hope everyone is doing good today. And I'm very excited for today's guest. You know, I've kind of had to run him down a little bit. I think he's been hiding a little bit, but we finally caught up with him. We have Jonathan Chalkley on with us today. Jonathan, how are you doing? How are you, Orly? I'm doing great. And Jonathan, first off, can you let everyone know your position with Cubica AMF? Uh, yes, I'm the training team services manager. So I manage our team of 10 full-time trainers and eight contract trainers as they go out and train our customers on our various products. And Jonathan, um, today what I wanted to kind of talk about was, you know, I've been kind of having some people asking about scrolling messages, what they can be used for and kind of how to do that. So first off, can you let everyone know kind of what scrolling messages can be used for and kind of what it is? Uh, yeah, scrolling messages within the Conquer uh, and the Cubica scoring systems have been around since Cubica brought the software to us through Boland X, uh, QScore, Bess, and now Bess X. Uh, it's just a scrolling message across the bottom of a minimum, a pair of lanes and up to the whole house. So it just scrolls across the bottom corner of the screen and it can do anything from displaying food and beverage offerings. Maybe you have a special going on and you want to kind of promote that or push that. You can kind of say, hey, head on over to the snack bar and grab this burger combo for five bucks. Uh, it can show stats for different tournaments. If you're running on the fly tournaments, you can put stats up there that will show who's in first, second, or third on the tournament. Uh, and then other things that you want to promote throughout the business. I know one thing with our new kiosks, a lot of centers are uh, promoting that we have a kiosk in the building and can be used for food and beverage, and they're promoting through the scrolling message, hey, instead of uh, walking up to the snack bar, head on over to our kiosk and use that for your, point, for your food and beverage uh, offering. Uh, so lots of different ways you can use the scrolling message within Conquer. Uh, very easy to set up and very easy to use. Okay. And so, for instance, you know, somebody wants to say, you know, like, hey, we just had a winner that won this and they key it in right there, you know, and, and they pop up the message there. But can they also preset this, like set it up earlier? Yes. So you can set up uh, 10 scrolling messages in Conquer under the front desk module and under lane features, scrolling messages. Uh, you can have up to 10 saved ones. Uh, what's nice about the scrolling message, too, is when you couple it with a bowling mode, you can have that scrolling message set to turn on or off at a 30-minute interval throughout the day. So uh, a real popular one that gets used is the last 30 minutes of the day, the center will have an automatic message that comes up that says, hey, the center is closing soon. Uh, please start to wrap up your games and also return your bowling balls and shoes uh, to their proper areas. So that can be set up ahead of time by the manager. It can be then set up through an automation through bowling modes to show up just the last 30 minutes that they're open. And that makes it to where the front desk staff doesn't have to do anything. It'll automatically go on and then it'll automatically shut off. And again, uh, these scrolling messages, what's nice is they can be customized to the pair of lanes minimum or through the whole house. Okay. And then one last time, um, where do they go to set this up? So from your Conqueror X home screen, uh, you can go to front desk, lane features, and then you can hit scrolling messages or messages. Uh, once you're in there, you'll see on the left-hand side, you'll see your 10 different saved messages. You can click on one of those and overwrite it at any time and save it as something new. Or you can just click on it, and then it's as easy as hitting down at the bottom, activate or deactivate. And that will turn it on and off. Okay, yeah, I appreciate that, Jonathan. Yeah, it's it's just another one of those features. You know, there's so many features out there that people aren't using that are, you know, that are very easy to use that can help them a lot in their center. So I appreciate you coming on today and kind of teaching us that, Jonathan. It sounds easy. It sounds like I could even do that. And, you know, so you made that sound really easy. I appreciate your time, Jonathan. And we hope we can have you back on again. Excellent, Orly. Yeah, head on over to your center and give that a try. Put up some scrolling messages and see how it works. I think you'll uh, find that it's useful for a variety of different things. Sounds good, Jonathan. You have a great one. You too. Thank you, Orly.